we've talked to you about after a number of exciting occasions when you committed to Tennessee, when you have won or named McDonald's All American. Uh-huh. Where does this win stack up? Um, you know, it means a lot. It was definitely a surprise. You know, I knew nothing about it till I walked into the gym today. You know, I was really excited to be in like a category with such like great players like that. It's amazing. Now, again, you said like you said it was a surprise. You saw McDonald's All American coming. You knew it for uh-huh. a couple of weeks, and you, know, you knew you were going to commit at some point. Does that make it this one a little bit sweeter? The fact that you didn't know it was coming. Oh yeah, because you know, it was crazy just because you know they kept it a secret from me. You know, I was very excited. Take us into that psychology class. Uh, um, from your perspective, Maya told her side of the story. What about you? Oh, yeah. I was in a psychology class, and we were in the gym doing, like, a hand-eye coordination activity where we, like, throw the ball and, like, catch it with one eye covered. And then, like, there was cameras in there, and I was like, why are they in, why are they in here? And I was like, oh, it's probably for that MTV made because they're, like, doing something with our school. So I was like, oh, whatever. And then I was doing it, and someone was like, turn around. And I looked, and it was mine, and I was like, oh, wow. Did you get starstruck a little bit? Yeah, I was. <laughs> <laughs> now, what did, um, you know, what did you, uh, what was the first conversation that you had with Maya? What would you guys talk about? Oh, she's like, did you know I won? Did you know you won? And I was like, I do now. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, obviously, uh, you've heard the list of names who have won this award before. Uh, to be in that, um, their, their company, have your name right next to theirs on that trophy. What does it mean to you personally? Oh, you know, it means a lot because I was looking at some of the names, you know, some of my role models and some of my favorite players, you know. It's definitely an honor. And did you think it was kind of funny uh, the fact that my UConn grad handed it to a, a future lady ball <laughs> yeah. last year? Yeah, it was a little funny. Because <laughs> Maya was saying last year, the winner was uh, a freshman who went to UConn. And yeah, and Tamika was the one who gave her the award, yeah. So it was kind of that? flopped this year. It was funny. <laughs> um, I mean, Mercedes. Um, oh, yeah, go ahead. No, just I mean, just I mean, how, I mean, overall, I mean, with your family and everything, I mean, just how is it just an overwhelming feeling, or is it kind of surreal, or? I'm um, a little bit, yeah, especially because it was all a surprise. But um, I was definitely excited when I got it. Now you also got another surprise during the ceremony. Family is going to going to Hollywood, going to the ESPYS. Yeah, what, what oh, I'm that? so excited for that. I mean, if I see Dwight, if I see Dwight Howard, I'll probably pass out or something. <laughs> That's good. Um, you know, as far as obviously Maya's walking the path that you would like to walk in, um, did you pick her brain at all for advice? Would she give you any advice? Um, no, but throughout the day I probably will ask her something. Yeah, you get to spend some time with her. Yeah. Um, what do you guys have playing? Um, we have to do like a little photo shoot, and my team's gonna play knockout with her later, so that'll be fun. Uh, you plan on beating her? <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Mercedes, congratulations. Thank you. And uh, as far as uh, you going to uh, Tennessee or whatever, how, I mean, how do you feel about going there? Oh, uh, you know, I'm very excited because I've always lived here, you know, all my life, so it'll be all new to me, but I'm ready for it. Right, do you have any plans? I mean, you're going from the Pacific Northwest yeah. to the South, so it's a little bit different. How do you feel about that? Um, I'm excited. You know, it'll be a new change, and I'm actually leaving early June, so it'll be all new to me. Is there any number one thing to do when you get there? Um, just work hard, you know.